Hello, I'm Chris Baltrop. I want to tell you about Equity's Live Entertainment Works campaign. Equity have worked long and hard to get licensing law reformed. Before it was reformed, a lot of premises felt they couldn't have live entertainment anymore because it was so complicated. They had to get out a temporary event notice or a premises license, and it costs a lot of money and trouble to do that. But now the licensing's been reformed, it's very easy for venues, that is your local pub, a hotel, a village hall, to put on an event. Now this isn't just about music, as you might imagine since I mentioned pubs, it's about performances of plays or comedy nights, duos, anything involving professional performers. And of course, that's why we're doing it, because we want to open up new venues for professional performers. The idea of making this short video is to show how easy it is and how you can get involved with helping to make it happen. So why should premises want to go along with this campaign? Well, apart from being good for us in, in making new places for artists to work, of course, the idea is it's good for them. It attracts customers, it makes a better atmosphere for, for drinkers in a pub, for people in a hotel, and of course, that all helps to raise profits. And if they raise their profits, they're more likely to keep going. That's a good motivation for venue owners. So, how do you get involved? Well, there are lots of venues near you. There must be the pub on the corner, a hotel, a, a small hall. Just pop in and see them. If they already have live entertainment, ask them to support the campaign by putting up one of these posters. That shows they support us and they support equity. If they don't know about it, and a lot of people don't, then the unions produce this wonderful leaflet which lays out all the details and makes people understand how very simple it is these days to put on live entertainment. If you pop in and the owner or the landlord Lord isn't there, then fill in the details on one of these special postcards and just give it to your branch secretary or post it to Guildhouse. Then the full pack can be sent out to those people. We're doing this right here because the Phoenix here in the West End was one of the first places ever to give us their support. We're very proud of that. Even in a busy area like here in London's West End, there are still premises that have closed down. We're standing next to a boarded up pub. Who knows, if this campaign had been made known to the people who ran that pub, maybe they wouldn't have had to close. Maybe they'd have been a live entertainment venue right now. Now, it's all very well me or other equity committee members talking up the campaign, but what we really want is for one venue to tell another and lots more. And the best way to do that these days is to produce a little bit of video of them talking, a pub landlord, a hotel owner, a village hall manager. It's very easy to do that. We'd like to ask you to do it for us, please. I've made up a little example. It's something you can do on a mobile phone. All mobile phones have a video facility. You can make a little video on this. And to show you the sort of thing we want the license owners to say as a recommendation, I asked a friend of mine, Billy, to make a short sample film. Hi there, I'm Billy Smith from The Red Line. Thursday nights have traditionally been a very quiet night for us. So recently we tried some live music and we found that that really helped and because of the changes in the licensing laws that was very easy for us to do and um, so thanks Equity, Live Entertainment Works. <laughs> 